A Grundy County man wants answers after coming home to find most of his show dogs dead. Good evening. I'm Latricia Thomas. And I'm Joshua. He says five of his show dogs died from poison, and right now one is in critical condition. News Channel 9's Mariah Rock tells us what deputies in Grundy County are saying about the investigation. The Grundy County Sheriff's Office says that they are doing everything they can to get to the bottom of this. Tony Young says that these dogs were not only dogs, they were his family, and someone took that away from him. My champion female, this, she was my pride, joy, pride and joy, and she hated chains. She didn't like chains, so I bought a kennel. Tony Young shows us the spots at his Grundy County home where he last saw his dogs before he left for a vacation. I got a phone call that my dogs were all here dead. Now these dog houses are empty, and chains that once kept his dogs in place are just laying on the ground. I rushed home, and when I got home, I found five dogs dead and one still alive. So, you know, that was a relief for me. I, I still had one. I thought I had lost them all. Grundy County Sheriff Clint Shroom says investigators believe the dogs were poisoned and the person responsible left six bags of what they believe is antifreeze nearby. We've taken it to the crime lab, uh, take a little while to get that tested, but it's, um, I mean, it's tragic. Young says these dogs were taken off their chains daily, not only for exercise, but to compete in dog shows all around. My dog screenshot won best of opposite, you know, best of show, best male, you know, and these were out of, you know, sometimes 40, 50, 60 dogs. His dogs were not only champions, but Young says he considered them family. These dogs were my best friends. You know, we went hiking, you know, everything together. Mariah Rock reporting the sheriff's office has sent samples of the poison found at Tony's home to the crime lab 